Good afternoon, everybody. Olav here, and welcome back to Sierra Saturday and Quest for Glory 5, Dragonfire. Hi. Can I talk to you? Uh, I've always admired a man who knows what he wants and gets what he can. Welcome to the Dead Parrot. I'll be happy to help you any way you want. I, I'm, I'm sure you are. If you want to play the wheel, I'll be happy to show you around. I'll be happy to see you whenever you return. I bet you will. Hi. Ooh, it's always nice to see a man who knows how to dress. It's nice to see a man who knows how to undress, too. I'll be happy to serve you whatever you like. So would I. <laughs> ladies, the ladies. The nice thing about bars is that there's always room for one more. Yeah, okay. Not terribly it's subtle. So sad to see you go. All right, is, uh, is... What's his name? The fat man here? No, he's not. Okay, but we do know... We do know that there is, uh, there is supposed to be a, um, a house up on Knob Hill that is good for, for thieving. Not going to be a whole lot left, apparently, because, well... And of course, we need to, we'll need to, to sneak around, around those guys. Assassination, Kikino was assassinated. Right of conquest, get the general shield. Standings after the... So it's the last, the last house. Next to here, okay. That is equipped, right? No? It is now. So my stealth is now 458. Examine the door. Pick the lock. Okay, well, go, go, go in. Ah, now see, this is where our torch comes in handy. Ignite, equip. The cupboard is difficult to open because someone's pulled off the handles. Looks like someone had to pry it open. Wow. Okay. That's a bit extreme. Examine the chest. Pick the lock. Someone's beaten me to it. The chest is empty. Well, now that's... That vase looks... That vase looks like it might be have worth something. Yep. Alabaster Amphora. Loose change. What about behind the painting? Aha! A concealed safe. With a trap on it, of course. So now we get to play our fun, fun, fun little uh, trap game here. All right, so disarm the trap. So, fountain, running, cave, goofy, fairy, tut, pitcher, and slider. All right. I'm just dropping everything all over my keyboard here. Okay, we're ready to go. What do you got for us first?
All right, that looks like the running man. That is the caveman. Yes. And that is the pitcher. All right, safe disarmed. Reach in. 300 drachmas and some jewelry. Y yes, I, I wanted you to close it. Actually, you know what? Let's take a look. Uh, no, I want you to look at the, the, the couch. There's always room in the cushions of the couch. Check in behind the back edge of the couch. You find a sort of pizza crust, crumbs, dust, a small gold ring. You decide to take the ring and leave the rest. Well, of course you would. Table. Anything in any of the jars? Oh, that's a that's that's for garbage. Okay, I didn't know. I didn't know. Move the painting. It doesn't move. It's nailed rather securely to the wall. Okay. Wait, we can exit up here? Why? Oh, wait. Can we go up and around and over and down? We probably could. But I don't know if that would be... I don't know if we would really need to or not. Yeah, we have two gro two ropey grapnels. Okay, so we could have gone up and in the, the top door. So we just have a lit torch sitting in our pockets. That's not good. Now, see, in theory, we should be able to come in here at some point and, like, bash them over the head. Basically, knock out all of the, knock out the guards in order to do, in order to, um, in order to keep them from, from seeing things. And then we can go in and, and break into the bank. I do know robbing the bank is a possibility. I also know that we can get the that the blackbird actually came to uh actually came to Silmaria. I think if I remember right from um from Spielberg with uh along with um the Baroness. All right. Good evening, matey. What can I be doing for you? Hi, I have some stuff that I would like to fence. Ha! Oh, you must be thinking this be some non-profit organization. You're trying to rub me bl Done. It's... All right, gold ring, 25? Oh, come on, you can go up to 35. Ha! Oh. You must be thinking this be some non-profit. You're trying to rub me blind. How about 30? Uh, look, this is me best offer. Done. It's a... It's me best offer. I'll take a little bit more. 75. Oh, you must be thinking this be some non-profit or... You're trying to rub me blind. 70. Look, this is me best offer. Done. It's me best offer. I'll, I'll, I'll give you one more drachma. Gonna raise. So yeah, we're doing good as far as money. We are doing really good as far as money. We're doing really well as far as, uh, you know what? We're gonna rest for an hour and see if Noir is, Noir is 
uh, up on the balcony. Whoa, pretty lady. Yeah, she is. What? Out late again? You need someone to keep you in bed at night. Well... Your voice is music to my ears. We should make sweet music together sometime. I was feeling a little lonely all by myself tonight. Really? I love to watch the rocking and rolling of the waves in the moonlight. I wouldn't mind a little rock and roll myself. A man like you does a lot to a girl like me. Well, that's, that's you good. You think that I am lovely? Yeah! Flattery will definitely get you somewhere. I love a man with a ready wit. Nothing risque, nothing gained after all. I'm trying to remember, did I pick up any flowers? I thought I had, but I guess not. A man isn't that just like a man. Always coming and going too soon. Really? Watch. I go really, really quickly. All right, so we'll sleep till morning. Now, if I remember right, there is... Mm, you know what? We might need a spear. We might need a spear... Because I think there's a way of going through it and going in and like up into, uh, up into the sewer basically and, uh, into the toilet. And basically, if I remember right, there may be, there's rumors of that if you sit there and wait in basically in the outhouse for long enough, the general will come Today's out. Street is goop soup with cabbage. That, that was they just asked. I don't want to know. But the, the general will come come out, go into the outhouse, and then you can, like, dagger up the jacksy. Not really a hot poker, because we don't have a hot poker. But, yeah, you can, like, jam him up the jacksy. Toro, do you have anything to say? Do you have any information as far as this? Oh, hey, is there anything new here? Right of freedom is over. Elsa not win, too bad. Water needed from the Hippocrene. Famous adventure, we already did that. Elsa not win, too bad. Why? Right one, all done. Hero man do good. It seems that you have done very well for the Ride of Freedom. Yeah. You'll do better on the next ride, I assure you. I bet you will. It is good to relax after the Ride of Freedom. I do not think we shall have much time to relax soon. Why do you need to relax? I did all the work. I am not proud of my performance in this instance. Minos insisted that I take his ship to the fishing village. He wished to send in some goon guards to aid me. I had a difficult time convincing Minos I needed no help. This ride of freedom was indeed a challenge. If this is only the first and simplest of the quests, then I look forward to the other rides. They will certainly prove which of us is more worthy of the crown of Silmaria. That man is very What do you irritating. think about Magnum He seems to believe that he is simply irresistible to women. I find him to be a braggart and a bore. He is not half the person he thinks he is. Yeah, I mean, he's definitely not irresistible to women. Me, on the other hand, well... God is very strange. The scientists lead him around as if he were a small child. The scientists speak for him. I do not think God has a mind of his own. His death was most tragic. No one deserves to die that way. We shall see each other at the Hall of Kings. Farewell. Yeah, by the way... Do you know this sign? Yes, you do. Elsa nods her head in acknowledgement and makes the counter sign. What is that? Legends say that only virgins can see unicorns. You pretend you can't see it. Hey, I am not a virgin. I totally got my groove on in uh, Wages of War. Just for the halibut, you say. He's hard of herring. Hey, that's the way the cods fall. Oh, you were horrible. 
Okay, I don't, I can't go in and like write down my deeds and stuff. That's what you're supposed to do at an Adventurer's Guild, if I remember right. You're actually supposed to sit down and you're supposed to basically write out um, all the stuff, you know, like, oh, uh, you know, Olaf the Geeky has defeated, you know, has freed all of these, you know, I went around and freed all of these, all of these villages, and I've done great and powerful stuff. Oh, right, he doesn't wake up until nine. All right, so now let's go in. Hi, buddy. Good to see you again. Got any stories you'd like folks to know about being a hero? I'm writing a new book. Well, actually... You've got enough stories to fill a book. Maybe enough to fill five books. Ha, ah, five games, get it? Ah. Good to see you, lad. Hi. So... Couldn't be better started a new chapter in my novel quest for glory story it's about this correspondence school graduate who wants to become king purely fictional of course oh yeah P pure purely purely pure, purely fictional if i know anything that will help you on the rights i'll let you know okay didn't like the last name i gave you no well how about this one gypsy davy i am called by when a lady follows me Blackjack Davy, raggle taggle as together we both flee. Though she leaves me for her husband when she tires of the game, still she blushes and looks wistful when she hears folks call my name. Keep right. on adventuring. Will do. You, um, try not to die? Wait, I know I need, I know I'm going to need a rock. I don't know if I have any rocks, but I know I need at least one rock. So we're going to go and see the scientists. But I left the, 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 the thing down here though. Duh. So yeah, this is, you know, as we pointed out, um, going to Science Island actually is a requirement. You do have to do it. Because that's where you make your wings that gets you to one island. All right. Oh, I did have some rocks, okay. Whoa. Still hit it, even when I was rocking. Now I think the other guy, the Dr. Mobius, is the the scientist on hand at night. So he's gonna be like a completely different, uh, he, you know, and he's got like completely different backstory and, and I think he likes a different pizza too. Mobius and I may disagree on methods, but we have many things in common. We both believe that science should rule the world. Right. Perhaps you're starting to get an idea of what can be accomplished with the aid of, like myself, God. Truly a product of science. Yeah, he's kind of a Frankenstein's monster. But that is all the time we have for today. Um, so we're, we're, we're well on to it. We've got plenty of money and stuff like that. Uh, but we do have other stuff that we need to get and gather up and stuff like that and everything. <sighs> As always, thank you guys very much for watching. And don't forget to broad the subscribe button down below so that you can stay tuned for more from Olav Productions. If you want to see some crazy, Here we go. so lazy, you should meet me and my friends. Problematic. Um, otherwise, it would have been like, oh, hey, here's a piece of evidence. No, it's just like, oh, okay, it's a leg bone. Whatever. They keep to themselves mostly, but they're also known to enjoy a fight if one is thrust upon them. Thrust one upon it.